What is up guys? That's here bringing you a battle spot, singles battle. Haven't done this one in a while. It's gonna be me on the left hand side using uh, Garchomp, Gengar, and Heatran versus Japanese person who's using Talonflame, Ditto, and Kangaskhan. This person had about 1650 ratings, so it's not that high, but the season did just reset. And, uh, you know, his team was just really, really strong versus my team who's okay, I want to say. I want to say my team is okay. Other stuff in my team that you guys can't see are things like Talonflame. Uh, what else did I use? I used, like, Suicune. There's a bunch of stuff I couldn't bring because it was a lot of setup stuff, and Ditto just crushes setupers. So I had to play my team a little bit differently, and I played a really cool game, which is this game I'm going to be showing you guys, and I figured I might as well upload it because this game is hilarious. And you guys can probably tell from the team preview that there's going to be some shenanigans going down with that Ditto. So we're going to see Japanese person starting off the game. I'm going to lead with my Garchomp. And we're going to see them lead off with their uh, Talon Flame. So right off the bat, you can expect me. I could just Dragon Claw after he Brave Birds me, and we'll trade. You know, I'll still be alive just a little bit, and he'll go down. But I don't want to take that trade. I'm a pretty greedy guy. I'm going to switch out to my Heatran to neutralize the damage from this Brave Bird. Pretty much, uh, I think Heatran's a great counter to Talon Flame, but you know, most people also do. Take about a quarter, and this is the coolest play I make all game. I know that he's also a greedy guy. He's going to switch out his Talon Flame because that's what you would do here, into his Ditto. Because everyone knows you want to get that Flash Fire Heatran in this situation on your Ditto. I call that and go for an Earth Power. Now, if you guys know Heatran is four times weak to ground attacks. He's going to get one-shotted by my Earth Power. And any like thoughts I had of losing this game are just gone because I made that super cool play. I have, I'm having a blast. Uh, but I do want to save my heat trying to check that talent flame later. So I am going to switch out and get another counter going, going into my Gengar to potentially wall out this Mega Kangaskhan. So we're going to see him pop his Mega. Bam. Gaining that parental bond ability, letting all his attacks hit twice. And I was talking with one of my teammates. I was explaining why I think Gengar, or well, more specifically Mega Gengar, is the perfect counter to Kangaskhan. And this, this is just another battle that showcases... You know why it is. So I'm gonna gain. I'm gonna Mega Evolve and gain the uh, Shadow Tag ability, and I'm just gonna pop a Destiny Bond. If he's running Crunch, he's dead. And if he Sucker Punch me that turn, uh, well, he wouldn't have killed me. But anyways, he goes for a Rock Slide instead, and it's gonna take me to about a quarter. I want to say that's a quarter, and I'm just gonna start spamming Destiny Bond because the next move that gets used after Destiny Bond will uh will take him out. So I use Destiny Bond. I went second because he used Sucker Punch. And then this turn, I get a free chance to attack. I go for a Sludge Bomb, I think, and he does, he Sucker Punched me, which means my Destiny Bond took him out. Which means, you know, I classify Gengar as countering Kangaskhan, because it's something can swap in on it and effectively take it out. Of course, it has to go down in the process, but, you know, I'm already really, really ahead this game. I'm going to send my Garchomp out. He's going to send his Talonflame back out. And this is the same turn one we had at the beginning of the game. He's going to go for that huge Brave Bird, but... It's not like it's going to one-shot a Garchomp, and even if it does, I still have my Talon, or my uh, Heatran in the back. So he's going to take that recoil damage, and my uh, my Dragon Claw is going to be enough to take him out. I do get the crit, but I know I didn't need it because I'm Life Orbed. So, yeah, there's my Life Orb damage right there. So anyways, guys, it's going to be a pretty, pretty quick game. I just want to showcase that really cool Heatran call and the Gengar counter into Kangaskhan. And I just didn't have a battle upload today, so I figured I might as well record this. So guys, thank you guys for watching. I hope you appreciate it. Leave any uh, comments you think below if you guys liked the battle, if you guys didn't like the battle. Leave those in, in the comments below, and I will see you guys next time.